Hey guys, it's Rodney over at Native Edge Landscape, and welcome back for another Worksite Wednesday. So today, guys, we're back in the beautiful Terrytown neighborhood on the west side of Austin to talk to you a little bit more about our metal trellises. We saw one in a recent post talking about how to screen utilities, but another great way to use these guys is in a small, narrow space to add some vertical interest, architectural detail, as well as privacy and to help with sound. So all of our trellises are going to be custom made to the size that best fits your property as determined with you and your designer. But after they're custom made, one of the first rules is going to be a proper install. Installation. So we'll see here how they've gone at minimum of 24 inches deep to hold this 10 foot tall structure. So of course safety is the number one priority when you're building a structure that stands 10 foot tall. Just like the footings being nice and deep, we're going to backfill that with a hard setting concrete. Another detail is to use a stable fence as a brace. We've custom fabricated these angle iron braces so that we can bolt off appropriately to the strong fence, allowing both sides the safety and peace of mind. One important detail to know whenever you're building above six foot at your property line is you wanna make sure to check with your HOA as well as any city code requirements. Here in the city of Austin, we have what we call a four fifths rule about anything above six foot. So with these open hot panels at four by four inch, they meet that rule perfectly. Once the trellis is installed and properly secured, we then backfill the space. We then prep our soil. We're gonna use a two parts compost mix to a one part native soil blend. And then we've also installed these little irrigation bubblers for that peace of mind in those hot summer months. 